Okay, so yesterday we finished installing all the windows. That's still covered up, we just got here. But uh, all the windows are in. And uh, now what I'm going to do is I've got uh, a couple of holes here and here to drill and we're going to uh, install this this bottom piece and uh, yeah this is gonna be this is going to be a trick getting this thing to go in but uh, yeah that's what we gotta do I guess we can take <clears throat> and uh, <coughs> clamp this down <coughs> oh, excuse me I guess what we got to do is clamp this down to this wheel well and just uh, work it as we go yeah that's the only thing I could do and uh, yesterday we received the uh, filler to do all this so that's good and uh, we'll go from there Yeah, every now and then you have a little this back end of the rivet in there and when you're trying to drill it's very hard to go through so you have to go back and knock it out and then it goes right through the other thing this is not important but it's something that I've seen people do on YouTube here when when you put this in here it snaps it off like this and you have this piece in here and I've seen people see it and it's just sitting here after it's done and they go this thing's not working but it is once inside of here you have three little uh, teeth that grab and pull back mm -hmm. once it snaps it those rings relax those teeth relax mm -hmm. and what you need to do is you need to go like this okay so you, it, you show it when you do it yeah uh, otherwise Otherwise, what happens is it's just stuck there and people think that the gun is not working. Mm -hmm. Show it. I'm going to show you. Okay. Here's what happens. All right. You take Number this, one. You take this and you put it in here. Mm -hmm. And you put it in here. Mm -hmm. You press firmly to make sure that it doesn't go anywhere. Mm -hmm. And you wait till the teeth reset. And then you hit it. Okay. And if you look, there's a little thing here. Mm -hmm. But if you go like this, it falls back here. Yep. And now there's nothing there. Yep. Yeah, this is uh, just gravity. There's no mechanical part to that at all. Bit, huh? You have, uh, we'll, uh, we'll eat some lunch and come back. And then, once we get this whole thing done, uh, put some filler on these parts here. And then we can put this 
in here. Okay. Uh, on one of our earlier videos on how to remove this, you'll remember, well, if you saw it, you'll remember, there's a little insert that goes in here, mm -hmm. and that is what's used to lock this. So you, this will actually slide inside of here and lock it in here. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, so when we come back, we'll continue. The hard thing about putting this thing back in is if you look over there, you'll see how it bows out. So you have to push this in and get it lined up with the holes and everything. Now, part of the reason that that happens is, of course, uh, this thing is just flapping in the wind. The sun hits it, stretches it, shrinks it, makes it wavy, and not to mention that we welded on this thing. Yeah. So all those combinations make it hard to line up those holes. But once you put this, and what I found is that if you start with your second one, work back this way and then go that way, it, it seems to be a lot easier because if you try to start at either end and bring it in, it's very hard to line it up. So mm -hmm. the best and thing to maybe do... Maybe you miss some of the, the hole well, the, because the is, they're going to push out and out and out. Yeah, but the thing is, is when you start here in the middle, mm -hmm. it helps you take that bow out. Mm -hmm. And as you go, ksh, 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 mm -hmm. it keeps pushing it down and lining it up okay. because that riveter, is half and half. Mm -hmm. That riveter, depending on which model you buy, mm -hmm. is three, four thousand uh, pounds of pressure. Mm -hmm. So, with your hands, with two Cannot. people, three, you can't get that kind of pressure. Mm -hmm. So that riveter helps you a lot. Mm -hmm. Once you get one started, and okay. two and three, it gets better and better. You know. So when we first lined up the, uh, the these things here, mm -hmm. we couldn't get this back to line up to save our life. So mm -hmm. we started with this one, right? Mm -hmm. Put a little bit each way, and then work back, Yep. and this came right in. Okay. All right, let's go eat, and we'll come back. Okay, see ya. All right. Okay, guys, there it is. We've got three more rivets to go up front, but you can say that this is on now. So what I will work on next is to put some filler in here and along the top of those there. And uh, yeah, then after that, we're gonna concentrate on sanding this up here. Sanding this here, removing that uh, louvered thing there and uh, sealing, sealing this here so that we can install this uh, corner back in. Yep. And uh, then we need to fill this all the way down. We need to remove these uh, door handles here and uh, adjust them because they're not right. Yeah, they're a little bit too far in. Yeah, so we need to do that. All right, right now the battery is charging because it ran out of juice. Uh, we'll take a little break and uh, yeah, go from there. Thanks for watching. See you next time. See you. Bye bye.